Good morning. It's the next day. It's 8.40. We were supposed to be ready by 9. <laughs> Today is Cape Play Fest. It doesn't start till 10, but we wanted to go get breakfast before. And I also want to visit a K-pop store that's nearby. I want to go there before we go to the event because the event is kind of further away. And then we're just going to be there the whole day. Oh, I came with my sister. I forgot to say. Yeah, we landed here last night around like 1030. And then we're leaving tomorrow. We're only here for a day and a half. So hopefully if it doesn't rain tomorrow, I do want to go to the Melrose. I don't even know what it's called. The farmer's market. It's like a market thing they do every Sunday where a bunch of sellers go and sell their clothes. And I've always been wanting to go. So hopefully it doesn't rain. If not. And we're just gonna go to the K-pop store again. <laughs> Whoa! I'm gonna put my makeup on now and get ready. Look at my shirt. There's cats. And in the back, shows their butt. Yeah, one of them's wearing weird underwear. Okay, BRBs. Okay, we just finished. This is my fit. I feel like I look bad. This is from Urban. It's really cute. I wore a tank top under. And then these jeans are really long. They fit like... I do know it's gonna be raining like really hard today, but I don't know if I want to take the puffer or just risk it all. Yeah. This is the bag I'm taking. I brought my little light stick. These are the PCs that I'm taking that hopefully I can trade. And then this is the PC, really cute. And I brought my Marchita blush. I'm making her carry one. Wait, don't look. <laughs> <laughs> this is the little bag. So you could attach it to your bag or something. <laughs> we can look now. Yeah. <laughs> so we're gonna go eat breakfast probably at the same place i went to last time it's called just cafe go to the k-pop store and then head to the k-play fest hopefully they let my big camera in i don't even know if they said no cameras but let's just hope Sunday mornings hiding under covers I don't mind staying in with you Play your favorite movie Laying right beside me I don't mind when it's just us two That corner coffee shop we like to go Late night walks with you to take me home With you I never feel alone These little songs make me glad to call you mine And you have got my head in the clouds One, two, three All that I need is your body next to me On rainy days, just need your company Don't need too much, just your simple love and it's Together, we always have fun throughout the day. I do anything to get your attention when you say you love me. I seem to ascend to the heavens above where we fall in love. I don't know what I would do without you because all I need, all I need is you. Make me fly to the clouds. One, two, three. All that I need is your body next to me on rainy days. Just need your company, don't need too much. Just your simple love and it's everything. The simple joy of hearing your voice every morning. I wake to a kiss on my face, so I don't need so much. Just your simple love and it's everything. Can't imagine living life alone. If we were to go a 
separate ways Cause with you I feel like Who knows how far we go Don't, Don't you know, know that, that all that I need I Is your body next to me on rainy days Just need your company I look tired. I'm trying to find the PC trading thing, but I can't find it. And I'm scared because I just bought the PCs for nothing. Stayed up till like 2 a.m. trying to figure out the ones that I want to trade. But I don't see it. Help me, help me. We just got back to our hotel. That was really chaotic. It started raining really bad. I got super soaked. This is how much got wet. Do you see that? Do you see how wet that is? My docks were filled with water and I was just sloshing around in water. It felt like someone was pouring like buckets of water in my shoe. The rain would just not stop. Trying to contact our Uber. It was just crazy. They weren't letting him in. We had to walk so much just to meet the Uber driver. I just took a shower. I feel better now. My feet are warm. We put the heater up to 1000 degrees because it's freaking cold outside. We ordered some Thai food because we didn't eat the whole day. We only ate that breakfast in the beginning. I got a lot of good stuff, you guys. Like, I'm not even kidding. Like, you're gonna fart. And if you've never farted in your life, you're gonna fart right now. Because I got so many cute things, first of all. This is the reason why I made it through today. I can't even, dude, I can't even. Basically, I went to the trading PC thing. First of all, I didn't even trade anything. I was too shy. And I noticed everyone was mostly trading straight kids or ATs. And I don't have any straight kids PCs. And all the ATs PCs I have, like, I want to keep because they're the only ones I have. <laughs> I did give someone a Sana PC because they really wanted it. And I was like, yeah, sure. We didn't think it was going to rain this bad. Because honestly, this kind of rain is like San Francisco kind of rain. I guess it rains over here. I always thought it was like sun and butterflies. Other than that, it was really fun. Loved seeing everything in person, seeing all the shops that like I've seen on Instagram or Etsy and whatnot. Also, sorry that I didn't really vlog that much when I was in there. Like, like I said, it was chaotic. I was carrying this huge camera and I was like carrying a bunch of stuff. Sorry that I didn't update you guys as much as I wanted to, but I hope you guys got a gist of how it was and i got to meet so many of you guys too which is so cute you guys are always so nice to me like i always want to cry so bad dude like i i can't and ugh. right now i feel like i didn't buy anything like in my head i'm like i feel like i didn't buy a lot but if you i did buy a lot i know i did this is when you know you have a shopping addiction we went to a little market that was like next to the K-pop store and I got some cute My Neighbor Totoro, the little lunchbox. I also got the matching silverware, so the fork, spoon, and chopsticks. And the reason why I bought this is because I'm going to school this semester and I'm trying not to spend too much on food. I don't know if I'm a cook, but I'm gonna take something. <laughs> or I'm gonna steal my sister's food. <laughs> After that, we went to the K-pop store. My sister ended up getting this keychain <laughs> of Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> Cause she likes buff men. Is he a man or a boy? Uh, Goku is the is the dad. Gohan is the son. Oh, so the one with the yellow hair is the son? No, he also gets yellow hair when he gets powerful. I don't and get it. His hair is black, so like he has powers. So I got their SM Mini. Don't tell me this comes with a PC. Does it? <sighs> I need to go back. I think it does. S mini, like little CD thing. I think it does come with a PC, but I didn't know that. So if it does, I, bro, I'm gonna walk back tomorrow and get more. They also sell really cute masks. So I just got a little, this peach one, the boys. I got one for myself and for Fernando because I really like the concept they did for this version. She was missing this version. So one of these is hers, happy birthday. And then this one is mine. And then I <laughs> 
This one's embarrassing. There's the Daikon, the Daikon D Festa. I couldn't decide if I wanted the NCT Dream version or the 127 version. And so I got both. And since I didn't buy a lot of albums, I was like, I might as well just get both, you know? That's one thing I don't like about that is that there's always like the mark for NCT Dream and then the mark for 127, which is like the same for Hechan stands. So we're both struggling here. That's all that I got at the K-pop store. And then... <laughs> it this is how wet everything was the bag ripped so bad my sister got this cute studio ghibli lanyard and it has like spirited away kiki's delivery service house moving castle she also got this other keychain which has a little i don't even know what these are like dust bunnies from studio ghibli what are they little black bolitas <laughs> A frog PC holder. <laughs> I'm gonna be using this one all the time. Like I already know. Some people were handing out some Nature Republic thingies and they handed out some dark spot serum samples. Oh, I didn't even realize this was NCT. I told you. I, I didn't tell you to look at Johnny. Oh yeah, you did. Oh, that's cute. Okay, this one is so exciting. I got another AT's hoodie because as we all know, the AT's hoodies that they sold at their tour were like really bad. Like people are complaining that after every wash, it's like rubbing away, which is so annoying. So I wanted to get like a backup hoodie of AT's because we all know I'm a huge at -y now. <laughs> I was staring at it for like a good five minutes debating if I should get it or not because it's like not that it's basically the same as a tour one but like it's like the same type like it's not like another color or anything but I ended up getting it because I just like been liking hoodies a lot more. I don't know if this is official but I got it from the sub K shop so I don't know if it's like official official or if it's like fan made. It has ATs embroidered on there and then the back eight makes one T. Yeah. Probably gonna wear it to work every day. I also bought us some face masks to do at night because we knew our night was gonna be rough. I got a chocolate and my sister got a banana one. Oh, this one's from Loved by Luna. And then what I also got from Loved by Luna, I also got these two tint. It works for both your cheeks and lips. And I tried it and it was so good in the shade 20. Basically looks like this and it was really bright. I got one and my sister liked it too. So she got one too. And it was cheap. It was nine bucks. I was like, dude, I'm sold. <laughs> I got invited by K Play Fest and they gave me like a goodie bag. And as you guys saw earlier, they gave me a t shirt and like a few stickers. It's just a light blue t shirt. And it says K Town Korea Limited. And then it has like the Monopoly dude. And I also got the lanyard and I really like the lanyard. They gave me an AT's cardboard set. And like I didn't buy this, but it was in the bag. So like I'm kind of confused. There were like some little candy machine kind of thing where like you enter four quarters when you take it out it gives you like pc of someone and i ended up getting a johnny one which my sister's gonna tattoo on her leg she told me <laughs> and then i also got a son one and he's giving out a little kit kat and it says 18 18 bro a tiny and then here are my <laughs> PCs that I never traded. <laughs> That's so embarrassing. I couldn't find the, the PC trading booth anywhere because it was outside. And so I went out there and I ended up seeing like a bunch of people. I ended up getting there and I got super intimidated because like I didn't know anyone. But then someone ended up recognizing me and then like I instantly felt a lot better. And so I just went to them and I was talking to them and then they were showing me like the PCs that they were trading. I ended up running into another person Oh. They ended up giving me their Doyang PC because they had an extra and they even decorated the top loader and I cannot believe I have this because I've been wanting this PC for years, okay, since I was born. And Fernanda pulled it and she didn't give it to me so she's fake. I was just chilling with them. I became like really good friends with them. They were really nice. One of them also gave me a Hongjun PC and he's one of my biases so I thought it was really cute. Look at his silver hair, bro. Don't even talk about it. Dude, Fernanda's gonna shoot me for this one. Fernanda, if you're watching this, no, you're not. And then, <laughs> what? I'm a frog freak. Look at me. The same person who gave me the Doyoung PC also gave me a blushy. Because they also like frogs, like me. Like, we're frog besties. Thank you so much. With every little thing they were giving me, I was like, you can't. I'm like, you need to be stopped. But yeah, I'm super grateful. <laughs> I'm gonna get robbed. Dude, Fernanda's gonna walk here all the way from SF and like choke me. The next shop that I went to is Uri Chingu. I got a lot of stuffs, okay? And all because of one man. And that man is Mark Lee. But I got this little pollito thing. And the reason I got it 
is because there's a little watermelon and we all know i don't even need to say it. and then i also got this cheetah pc holder because we all know i don't even need to say it mark lee is a cheetah wait i don't know if this is a cheetah but it looks like a cheetah it looks like a tiger but it's the same thing i also got collect books because one that i got like ripped and i've just been running out of space so i got this cherry pink one it's really cute and then i also got the tiger one so the one that matches with the pc holder for now if you're watching this don't watch this part because we're ending our friendship right now some k-pop shops that were there selling albums were also selling pcs and i ended up buying this headshot they were three bucks bro i know but i think it's because they're from the daikon so they're not like expensive but i got a headshot one and then i also got this renjun pc for fernanda because i don't think she's gonna buy the daikon and this one i'm sorry fernanda but it's mine i tried so hard to find another one and i couldn't I feel evil for keeping it from you, but I, I can't. There was also another shop, and I'm pretty sure you guys have heard of them, but they're Bora Studios. They gave me like a little baggie, like a goodie bag. They gave me some, oh my, oh. no they didn't, no they didn't. Wait. They gave me little watermelon stickers. They gave me a piece, like a PC book like for pcs it's so pretty stickers to decorate your top loaders they have so many cute stickers so many different themes flowers and hearts and bows every time we went there it was always busy because everyone like wanted to buy what they had and then the next place where i went i fell in love with this shop so bad their etsy shop is ducky crochet house 100 percent handmade oh my gosh look at this purse there was a lavender one but my sister said this one fit me more and i agree look isn't it cute mm -hmm. <laughs> and it's like a rose and it's so pretty a tulip a blue tulip i wanted to get a lot more i just stuck with one for now this one is insane to me look at that it's a little frog and it has a little backpack see i'm obsessed with frogs it's bad this one is from ordinary affair my sister got a bts crew neck it says life stops going give up <laughs> <laughs> it says life goes on. They have so many cute crew necks, t-shirts, tank tops. I really like their AT's bomber jacket. I think that's what it's uh, called. The one she was wearing? I like that one too, but it's the blue one. It's really cute and it's blue. Since I recently got into AT's too, I got their t-shirt. Oh, it's wet. But it's just water, so it's okay. It says Gorilla. It makes one team. A to the Z. This is my favorite shade of green, like the matcha green. And then the back says the fellowship break the wall 2022. Oh my gosh, fun fact, during the random dance play, when ATs came on and when they played Gorilla, the whole it was loud. it was so loud. Like I was half asleep because I was like I hungry and I was like passing out. As soon as I got to that song, everything was shaking. Okay, the rain stopped. I couldn't believe it. It was so funny. I wish I had recorded it, but my phone was like a hundred yards deep into my backpack. And then I also got tank top, their BTS tank top, and it says, Oh, this is one of my favorite songs from them. And the song slaps. I'm gonna be posting about these on my Instagram. So if you guys want to go see how I styled it, go right now. Go buy it because they have so many cute things and you're gonna cry and fart is that all i got i'm like is that all i got as <laughs> there's like a huge mess it's so long right yeah it's kind of a mess pretty much everything that i bought i'm pretty sure we asked for fresh coconut but we didn't think it was gonna be an actual coconut it's so good really i'm gonna eat i also got my period today and so did my sister i know call the ambulance <laughs> I was supposed to get it a few days ago. Sorry, TMI. I was supposed to get it a few days ago and like I didn't. And I'm like, okay, I'm gonna be prepared on this trip in case I do get it. The second we get to the K Play Fest thing, I go to the bathroom and like, boom, surprise. I was like, great. Yo no ir al baño. And my sister didn't want to go to the bathroom, but she's like, oh, let me just go right now. And she got it too. Can you believe what a crime? And it was raining. Okay, I'm gonna eat food now. I'll see you guys later in our face masks. Woo! I'm doing the chocolate one. She's doing the banana. Hello, is everybody watching? Before I could mm -hmm. start started. <laughs> <laughs> but I said it backwards. Did I say I get the started party? <laughs> Chill. Okay, we're gonna lay down and put our feet up.
We're leaving. Sad face. Cry. We just finished eating breakfast at the same breakfast place we went yesterday. And they remembered us. So we're basically mm. regular. Regular, huh? And after I wanted to come to the little Tokyo little mall thingy. And I wanted to get Sony Angels, but literally no store had it. So I don't know if they're like, if there's like a shortage of Sony Angels. I know they've become like super popular, but but I did buy this because I've been wanting one of these and we've been traveling like a lot more than usual. I'm like, I should invest in a good one. When we went to San Diego, my sister bought one and she's dumb and she didn't bring it today. Boo. I bought one and I'm gonna let her use it because I'm a good sister. And people think she's my mom. <laughs> Which is funny. She's my sister. I always laugh when they think she's my mom. My sister bought a little Gigi figurine. She's a Gigi boo. It's not raining today, which I'm happy. I want to go to the Melrose Trading Post. But we have to carry our luggage, which I'm not excited about. But she's got it because she goes to the gym. So, so we're going to go now and <laughs> you look like a little ant. <laughs> I am back for my trip. Apologize for not vlogging a lot towards the end there. We ended up going to the Melrose Trading Post, which was really fun. The only downside is that like we were carrying our luggage, so it was really heavy. And I wasn't able to like shop as like calmly and relaxed as I wanted to. But my sister ended up staying at some benches and just staying with our luggage while I went to go shop. She didn't really want to buy anything, so we mostly went there for me. <laughs> I felt a lot more relaxed, a lot better when I was able to just walk around by myself and like without having to carry anything and just like actually look through the clothes in a much more slower pace. The funny thing is that I was texting Fernanda too while I was there and I told her how I was feeling a little bit like insecure and a bit overwhelmed because LA is very like LA. The Melrose Trading Post is very like <laughs> LA too like there was a lot of attractive people okay and I get really insecure when there's a lot of pretty people I was being very shy and I was just anxious the whole time that made me too shy to even approach the shops that were there and to actually look through the things that were there I'm sorry for my birds they will not shut up but then eventually I was like you know what screw this I'm shopping everyone else is shopping everyone is minding their business so it shouldn't even matter but it's just kind of sad how like one little feeling of insecurity or like anxiety will like prevent you from doing what you want to do which is like shopping or like other things immediately after that i was just like i want to go home <laughs> <laughs> like I miss SF but I want to show you guys what I got so the first thing that I got was this very cute denim dress it's very like doll look and I've been looking for a dress like this for a long time and so when I found this I was like whoa I didn't even try it on so hopefully it fits it was the first item that I found and then as soon as I bought it I felt super like okay let's get this shopping spree started and I feel a lot more comfortable going to like the other shops I made multiple loops looking at each shop more than once just to see if like I missed any Thing. The next thing that I bought, look at that. I don't know what is with me in finding purses with Mark's initial on it. I've never seen this many initials on a purse before and usually on purses it shows like the brand. So let's say you're buying a purse from like Chanel. You know, it's gonna say Chanel or like C. I was just walking around the trading post and I come across this one shop that I had walked by multiple times and there were these two sweetest Latina señoras and I was like, I want to be you when I grow up. It was the only little purse hanging on top of their post that they had there. When I saw, when, first of all, every time I see something green, my eyes automatically go to it. But then I saw the M and I was like, there's no way that this is in front of my eyes right now. And I went inside the shop and I was like... I'm like, ¿cuánto cuesta? And they were like, 22. And I was like, bet. And just the fact that it's green too, like, I don't know. <laughs> I know I probably sound crazy, but I don't care. I wish I had found this before I went to the NCT, like their concert. I would have worn this and it's green and it would have matched very well in my outfit. But that means I'll just have to wear it the next time I see NCT. I feel like I don't run into a lot of purses that have like some type of initial on it. You know what I mean? And then when I do, it's like the letter M. Number one, old. 
I knew I wanted to buy some jewelry because I really like jewelry. I came across this ring and this one is from Nadi and Low Jewelry. This is their business card in case you guys like it too. But it's a star ring and I love stars. They remind me of Coraline. And the cool thing about this one is that you can adjust it. So if you want it tighter, you can just squeeze it and make it tighter. If you want it bigger for like your thumb, you can squeeze it open to fit your thumb. And when she told me that, I was like, okay, sold. And it came with a little pouch. And then the last two items I bought, the first thing I saw was this Harley Davidson velvet. I don't even know what kind of hat you would call this. Like ship hat? It looks bad on me right now. You know the crazy part? I know people are probably gonna think I'm like some like crazy Mark Stan, but I don't know guys. Okay, what well, I don't need whatever. He's my buy, so well, I don't know how else to put it. NCT's new comeback or the repackage for AO. Mark <laughs> He's wearing one of these. He's wearing a hat like this. Oh my gosh, you better believe I'm gonna recreate those pictures, yeah. And I saw Jungwoo is wearing a beret. I just love hats. And the next item that I bought from that same shop, very cute lace tank top. It has a little bow. It's very much like cottage core. I agree, it's not really my style. I don't think I've ever worn something like this, but I really fell in love with it. I know sometimes I'm into like that kind of doll look and like cottage core kind of vibe. I fell in love with the corset kind of look to it. I have a lot of outfit ideas for this one, so I'm really excited. This is such a good find, you guys. I couldn't believe. And the fact that I was too scared to go to up to these shops because I was feeling insecure, like screw that. And then if you guys have been to Melrose or if you haven't, that whole street is, there's a lot of shops Shopping. A lot of stores, there's like Foot Locker, a lot of restaurants, cafes, there's an Urban Outfitters, a lot of shops like that. And I wish we had more time because I definitely would have gone to all of those because I saw a lot of more vintage shops there. I did go to the Urban Outfitters because we all know I'm a huge Urban Outfitters consumer. I mostly wanted to see how different it was there to the one in my area. And it was pretty much the same, but I did find these socks and they're really fuzzy and they're big. And then the other thing that I got was this long sleeve. I'm starting to love shirts that have this cut. I think it's very flattering to me and I just overall like to show like my collarbone and just like this area, especially if I'm wearing like really cute necklaces that'll really stand out. Right after that, we went to the airport and we just stayed there. We ate food. We actually ended up upgraded to first class because they were being kind of annoying with like the bag thing. So we were like in the second row, which was like the closest we've ever been to the door. But it was really nice because as soon as the plane landed, we were one of the first to leave and get home. I know I still need to unbox the Daikons and the Boys album. I'm gonna do that in another video. I know, I'm sorry and I'm annoying. My room is a huge mess right now and just having to unbox <laughs> albums right now seems a bit messy and chaotic so i just want to clean my room first and then eventually film that just look at how my room looks like what is that hello thank you to kate playfest for inviting me this was my first time ever being invited to a convention or like influencer kind of thing so it was really exciting i had a lot of fun and i definitely want to go back that's basically everything for this video i hope you guys enjoyed if you guys went to kate playfest i hope you guys had a great time and if you guys are going to a kate playfest in the future so i hope you guys have fun thank you to everyone who said hi to me i befriended a lot of people and i made a lot of new friends so if you guys did say hi to me just know that it meant a lot to me and you guys made me feel better about everything going on i hope you guys have a great rest of your day or night don't forget to follow me on my social media on my instagram tiktok pinterest yeah stay safe you guys and i will see you in my next video mm -hmm.